Welcome to Learn Commerce PU Online Classes. forget to like our video and subscribe our YouTube channel for all the updates. Hello everyone, welcome to First PUC Statistics Online Classes. In the previous class, we had discussed about how to formulate discrete frequency distribution and how to solve the problems using that formula formation. Okay, now, let's see the second problem that is the number of doctors serving in 40 different hospitals were recorded. Prepare a discrete frequency distribution. See, here some observations are given. So, for this ob observation, I will apply discrete frequency distribution. Okay, I will write in the form of discrete frequency distribution. See, before that, I will find range. What is the range formula that we discussed in the previous class? Range formula is highest value that I will write HV, highest value minus lowest value. So, LV in the sense what? Lowest value. First, I will search highest value in this problem. So, in this problem, highest value is 9. So, 9 minus, what is lowest value in this? So, here lowest value, I think 3 is lowest value. So, in the uh, under th lowest value, I will write 3. So, 9 minus 3 is 6. So, here range is 6. So, see, first column, we know that that is variable. So, here variable, what is variable here? number of doctors. So, under here variable column I will write number of doctors. Yes, no uh, and or else we can write here we know that variable is denoted by x. So, here I will write x and second column that is tally birth. And the last column is frequency. We know that frequency is noted by F. So, here I will write F. So, what are the variables are given? So, here range is 9, 9 minus 3 in the sense what? 6. So therefore, see here lowest value 3. So, I will start value from 3. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 up to. See here highest value is 9. So, I will stop at 9. See here the x variables are 3, 4, variable values see 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Then what tally bar, how to put tally marks? See, see the first observation that is 6. So in front of 6 I will put one tally mark like this. Next is 7, so in front of 7 I will put tally mark like this. Next is 5, next is 7, next is 6, next 3. So here 3 here. 3 is here. So, in front of 3, 1 tally mark. Next is 9. Next is 8. Next 6. 7. 5. 7. 6. 8. 5. Then 8. See here 8. Yeah, 8. 5. 9. Then 5. See here 4 marks are over. So, next 5th one like this. Next is 6. See here six, in 6 also in front of 6. See here 4 marks are there. 5th one like this. Next 5. So, next I will put here 9, 6, 6, 4. So, 4 is here. Next again 4, 7. So, see here 4 marks are over. 5th one like this. Next 5th, 5, I am sorry. Next again 5, 8, again, next 5, 3, again 3, 8. So, 8. See here 4 marks are over. Next 5th one like this. Next 4, 4, 3, 4 like this. Next 4, and 3. So, 3 here 4 marks are over. Third, fifth one like this. So, see these are the tally marks. Next, I will write frequency. Okay, using this tally marks, we can write frequency. 
frequency in the sense what frequency is number of times observation repeated so this tally marks shows that how how many times this number is repeated see here three repeated five times so in under frequency i will write five next here four repeated six times is five plus one that is six next here five repeated five plus four in the sense what nine times then six repeated that is five plus two in the sense what seven times then here seven repeated five times then eight repeated five times and nine repeated three times and it should be equal to this total we know that total frequency is noted by capital letter n and this total should be equal to how many uh, 40 okay let me check that that is 5 plus 6 plus 9 plus 7 plus 5 plus 5 plus 3 see this total also equal to 40 Okay, this is the first problem and this is discrete frequency table. See, this is discrete, discrete frequency table. Okay, next, let us move to third problem. So, third problem is following is the doctor recording the number of metro, metros observed in 30 different days to observatory. Tabulate above, below info, uh, observation. So, here in observations are given. First, we need to find range. So, what is the formula to find range? Range formula is highest value minus lowest value. So, in this problem, highest value is, see I think 10 is highest value. So, under the highest value, I will substitute 10, 10 minus lowest value. See here lowest value is 2. So, here I will substitute 2. So, 10 minus 2 that is 8. So, here range is 2. See here range is too small, so we can go with discrete frequency distribution. Okay, so to how to form it discrete frequency distribution? First column is variable and variable is denoted by x. So here I will write x. Next is tally bar. The last column is frequency, and we know that frequency is denoted by small letter f. So how to write variable value? See. So, here lowest value is 2. So, I will start with 2. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. See, here the highest value is 10. So, I will end with 10. So, next, how to put tally bar? See, the first value is 7. So, in front of 7, I will put one mark like this. Next is 4. So, in front of 4, one mark. Next is 2 in front of mark 5, 9, 7, 4, 3, 8. See here 8 is there. So, in front of 8 one mark. Next is 6, 9, 10, 3, 3, 5, 9, 5, 7, 6, 3, 8. Here it is 8. 8, 4, next 3. Next 7, 9, 8, 10, 6, 8, 7. So, 7 is here. Okay, this is tally bars. Next, next, okay, now I will write frequencies. What is frequency today? Frequency in the sense what? Number of times variable repeated and tally bars shows also number of times variable repeated. So, that count and write here. Okay, I will count these observation and these marks and write in under frequency. See, 2 repeated only one time. So, in front of F, I will, here I will write 1. Then here 3 repeated 5 times. So, here I will write 5, then 4 repeated 1, 2, 3, 3 times. So, 4 is un, in front of 4, here frequency is 3. So, here class frequency is 3. Then 5, 3 times, 6, 3 times, 7, 5 times, 8, 4 times, 9, 
4 times and 10 is 2 times and we know that total frequency is denoted by capital letter N. So, capital letter N is equal to C, this of total frequency should be 30 because here 30 observations are there. So, we have to get this total frequency is 30 that I will check. So, 1 plus 5 is 6 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 5 plus 4 plus 4 plus 2. So, this total capital letter N is equal to 30. So, here we got same values. Yes, this is formation of discrete frequency distribution. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like our video and subscribe our YouTube channel for all the updates.